Hello. And welcome back to Chill Project Zomboid. Now, I just realized something. Scratch the idea of making a rain collector because there's a gigantic lake right here. All we gotta do is just boil the water and we'll be good. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. I still do want to get some carpentry skill, but in order to get up our carpentry skill, we're going to need to disassemble stuff as well as um, reading up on books to have a skill multiplier. Let's work on our farm. Let's read this farming magazine as well as this hunter magazine. Now, where am I going to put it? Uh, I'll probably have it here. I'll just remove these patches of grass. So it looks like we are starting a strawberry farm and sow those seeds. Well, there's our farm, pretty simple. And now let's get on to doing carpentry. This is going to involve a lot of reading. It's getting late, get some sleep. We'll continue reading in the morning. Perfect, let's get back to it. Now let's get some breakfast, eat up on some canned potato and let's get to disassembling furniture in these homes. And there we go, that is our fourth level in carpentry. We're getting neck pain from sleeping in a chair. Oh well. Let's check up on that farm, see how it's doing. All right, they're all looking good. This is future AA Ron talking. And silly me, I forgot to unpause my recording while I went off to do something. But right now I'm just gonna give a quick brief description of the plan that I had before I continue with the video. And I'm gonna be using MS Paint to explain my plan. So the plan was to leave home, come down to the gas station, pick up gasoline that we needed for our generator as well as you know making runs in the future then looping back around to the school to pick up some extra carpentry books or anything else that we need then drive back home and set up for a long-term survival now with that all out of the way let's continue don't damage my car the gas station should be coming up pretty soon and here it is fossil oil All right, let's clear out any stragglers and hope we don't die. Hey, 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 get away from my car. Oh yeah, there's a lot of them. Holy crap. This is gonna be one long endurance fight. And it's not particularly the time for it either. My, my mouse is, my mouse is bugging. I don't know what's happening. Pray to God I don't die. You know what, it's times like this, I wish I brought some Molotovs. Yeah, we're gonna have to lure the group uh, away. This isn't manageable, uh, not with these moodles. We're getting thirsty, tired. We'll call out and we'll lead them all off into the woods somewhere and we'll loop back around. Now I'm thinking we could bring them into this warehouse if there's not too many already in there. All right, bring them into this building then loop around, just run. I think I trapped most of them in that building. Alright, I think we're good. I don't think they followed me. Let's take some sleeping tablets and let's sleep on the floor in this room. And we'll see if there's any zombies outside in the morning. Okay, it's 6am. I'm not hearing anything. I think we're okay. Oh, there's one. Let's get what we came here for. And that's cans of gasoline and or bottles. We're gonna fill up everything we got. Okay, awesome. We got a full tank of gas for our van, plus a lot extra in the back. Muffin, yes, and dehydrated meat. And now let's swing by the school and pick up that carpentry book. Oh boy, we are in. Okay. All right, now I really wish I didn't take Sunday Driver. Oh man, that was that was intense. Fuck you, zombie. Ooh, man. Yeah, the van's getting pretty banged up. Specifically, the hood. It's 
kind of hard to dodge them when they're everywhere. This should be quick, in and out, get the book, leave. Big issues that we're tired. We've already cleared out this place, so it shouldn't be too difficult. We'll cut in through the lunchroom and make our way to the library. We need volume three. That's volume four. I guess I'll take it. Carpentry volume three. Come on. Really, man? Am I not finding this book? You gotta be joking, right? I'm finding Carpentry volume five, four. But I'm not finding the third book. Oh, man. That sucks. I mean, there's gotta be a book somewhere in this entire school. I'm going upstairs. I'm seeing if there's some carpentry books. Actually, you know what? Let's just bail. Let's get out of here. There's no books. I guess we're not getting our carpentry up. Jesus Christ, man. We're in the apocalypse. Speed up a bit. Yeah, the front of the vans. It's looking kind of rough. But, eh, who cares? We got gas. And that's pretty much all that mattered. The book was kind of just like a second thing. We just needed gas for the generator. Oh, finally we're back. After all that time. I'm grabbing all this gas and I'm fueling this generator. We've got 100% fuel and 100% condition. We'll dump the rest of this gas in the back of the van and let's park it. Oh my god let's see how our farm is doing they're flourishing well watered yep they're doing good man we're beat let's sleep in our nice lawn chair well by the looks of things we are pretty much set for long-term survival we've got ourselves a generator with lots of power a vehicle and a nice big lake we can get free water from a farm for food and also we can fish from the lake as well for even more food and we can cook said food in this fireplace right here and store it and keep it cool in this fridge we have everything that we could ever possibly need oh my god it only took us you know about 17 days let me know if you have any other ideas of what to do in this chill pz series and as always if you have any ideas for a video in the future, please let me know, and I'll see y'all later.